Hey guys, welcome to Lakeshore RV Center. Let's take a look at your Gray Wolf 26 DBH. Up front we've got your uh, propane tanks all filled up, new 12 volt battery on there. Got access to your water heater, crank down on your uh, stabilizer jacks. You're going to have little spouts for the rain gutters. Help take the water away from your camper. Underneath we've got a low point drain valves. On the back here, we're going to have a connection for filling your fresh water. Uh, so if you are running your onboard holding tank, you're going to put a fresh water hose in there and fill it up. If you're running off of city pressurized water, you're going to connect there. And you're going to make sure your water pump is turned off when you're on city water. Turned on when you're on your holding tank. Outside shower. Access to your uh, storage underneath your bunk. And then your let off for your gray and your black tanks. Rack storage on the back. And you also have your spare tire. Second door entry to the bathroom. And right next to it is going to be the sewage flush system. So when you open up your black tank to let it out, you can hook up a fresh water hose and uh, spray out that black tank got your power awning and LED lights, outside speakers, mount for your TV, cable and satellite hookup, outside kitchen, ice maker, two burner cooktop. There is a little red lever to lock it in place for when it's out and about. Coming inside, let's take a look at her. And walk right into the master bedroom. LED lights are in the ceiling. Each one is going to also have a little push button to turn the lights on and off. I think I have the master switch over here turned off, so let's flip those on. There we go. So you can individually control them as well. Radio with HDMI line, Bluetooth, electric fireplace, on and off settings, flame, color change, temperature. Um, there's a timer on there so it shuts off as well. Got a jackknife sofa here. Big drawer storage on your U-shaped dinette that will drop down for sleeping carbon monoxide and CO2 uh, right there for you monitor. You've got your thermostat for your heater as well as your AC unit. Just simply touch the big button and it'll take you through those cycles. Foot flush toilet. It is winterized of course because it is that time of the year. Big fantastic fan inside the ceiling. Down here you're going to have your fuse panel and breaker box, so if there's an electrical issue, start there. It's usually the best place to go. We've got your battery disconnect on, so it's running off of the 12 volt battery, charged by the solar panel on board. When it's time to shut it down and not drain the battery or have the systems working, go ahead and flip that into the off position. Right now your uh, 12 volt fridge is running off of that solar panel. Although I think my hands are colder than this. <laughs> it's a bit chilly out today. We've got your glass top cover for your three burner cooktop. I'm going to flip that over once. Flip it over one more time. And that's going to give you access to your three burners. Magnetic cutting board is fixed to the wall there for you. LED backlight. Got your keys waiting for you. Nice big stainless steel sink. I'm going to send you a couple extra videos for winterizing so you have that as well. And uh, there is your beautiful new camper. Look forward to seeing you guys soon. If you have any questions, please give me a call. April Welch. Oh, let's do one more thing real quick. 
check out the convenience station. So we've got your water pump, water heater, your main lights, your slide lights, convenience lights are outside, and uh, awning lights, and then your slide box and your power awning. Go ahead and bring that on in. All right, guys, well, I look forward to seeing you soon. Any questions, call me at 231-638-7750.